Hey, Crydersville Elementary students. My name is Mr. Cutnaw, and I am the assistant principal at Wapak Middle School. Um, I guess a lot of you guys probably know Mrs. Cutnaw, who is my wife that teaches second grade at Crydersville. And I'm really excited to get to meet you guys, and you guys get to see me, and also get the opportunity to share my son's favorite bedtime story with you guys. So today we're going to read a book called Dragons Love Tacos. Dragons Love Tacos by Adam Rubin, illustrated by Daniel Salmoneri. Hey kid, did you know that dragons love tacos? They love beef tacos and chicken tacos. They love really big gigantic tacos and tiny little baby tacos as well. Why do dragons love tacos? Maybe it's the smell from the sizzling pan. Maybe it's the crunch of the crispy tortillas. Maybe it's a secret. Either way, if you want to make friends with dragons, tacos are key. Hey dragon, why do you guys like tacos so much? But wait, as much as dragons love tacos, they hate spicy salsa even more. They hate spicy green salsa and spicy red salsa. They hate spicy chunky salsa and spicy smooth salsa. If the salsa is spicy at all, dragons can't stand it. Why do dragons hate spicy salsa? Well, just one drop of hot sauce makes a dragon's ears smoke. Just one single speck of hot pepper makes a dragon snort sparks. Spicy salsa gives dragons the uh, tummy troubles. And when dragons get the tummy troubles, oh boy. If you want to make tacos for dragons, keep the toppings mild. Tomatoes, check. Lettuce, check. Cheese, check. All of these are good toppings for tacos for dragons. Hey dragon, how do you feel about spicy taco toppings? Oh, my belly. Dragons love parties. They love costume parties and pool parties. They love big gigantic parties with accordions and tiny little parties with charades. Why do dragons love parties? Maybe it's the conversation. Maybe it's the dancing. Maybe it's the comforting sound of a good friend's laughter. The only thing dragons love more than parties or tacos is taco parties. Taco parties are parties with lots of tacos. If you want to have some dragons over for a taco party, you'll need buckets of tacos, pant loads of tacos. The best way to judge is to get a boat and fill the boat with tacos. That's about how many tacos dragons need for a taco party. After all, dragons love tacos. Hey dragon, you excited about the big taco party? Oh yeah. Just remember, dragons hate spicy salsa. Before you host your taco party with dragons, get rid of all the spicy salsa. In fact, bury the spicy salsa in the backyard so dragons can't find it. See, there he is, he's burying that salsa in the backyard. These dragons love your taco party. They love the music. They love the decorations. They especially love the tacos. Congratulations. It's a good thing you got rid of all that spicy. Wait a second. What are those little green things in the salsa? You didn't read the fine print? Fine print says, now with spicy jalapeno peppers. Dragons, listen to me. Do not eat those tacos. Those little green specks in the salsa, those are jalapeno peppers. They are super spicy. I know you love tacos, dragons, but you are not going to love those tacos. Do not let those dragons eat those tacos! <laughs> Too late. <laughs> Why would dragons help you rebuild your house? Maybe they're good Samaritans. Maybe they feel bad for wrecking it. Maybe they're just in it for the taco breaks. I 
After all, dragons love tacos. The end. Thanks a lot, Crydersville. Have sweet dreams.